And as it happens, I would like to say something about fire and look at it from the standpoint of chemistry and what that might reflect back to us about our human experience. For fire to be ignited in a substance, it has to reach a temperature at which it could combust. There are three relevant points. The first one is the flash point. The flash point. The flash point is that temperature at which a substance will combust when presented with a spark of ignition. But at the flash point, the fire cannot be sustained. There's enough to flash. It's the proverbial flash in the pan, but that fire doesn't sustain. There's another higher temperature, which is called the fire point. That is the point at which not only will the substance catch fire, but that combustion will sustain itself. It will keep burning. There's a third temperature mark. It's the auto ignition temperature. The auto ignition temperature is that temperature that causes spontaneous ignition. So without a spark, that substance will spontaneously ignite at that temperature. I suspect the relevance to our own human experience is obvious and immediate. It is to me, whether we look at it from the standpoint of ourselves as an individual or what we share collectively, we need something more than a flash in the pan. The substance of our energy, the vibration of it, the rate at which it vibrates has to rise sufficiently so that not only does it reach a flash point so that something happens if there's some ignition brought into that substance, perhaps an inspiration from someone else. But beyond that, once a spark is brought in, that combustion can sustain in the substance. And yet we look beyond that to this point of auto ignition, where as an individual, and perhaps this is a definition of spiritual maturity, as an individual, we are no longer reliant on the spark from somebody else, but we have the ability to spontaneously combust ourselves. Our vibrational level has re reached a point where it is burning. There's the eternal flame that's present with us, in us, through us. We've reached that vibrational state. 